A calm morning on the lake. Birds swooping in for a landing. A very suspicious turtle. And of course, alligators. You can see all types of wildlife with just a short drive up US 431 to the Eufaula National Wildlife Refuge. The refuge is located about seven miles north of Eufaula. There are more than 11,000 acres to be explored on foot, bicycle, car, and boat. Our first stop, Refuge Headquarters, to meet up with Refuge Manager John Earl for a tour. This is also where you can pick up park maps and a birding guide. Our biologist has done an excellent job. It's, it's almost like this is a canvas for him. And he's got a diversity of thickets and creek bottoms and agricultural fields, an amazing panorama of, of habitats. There's over 100 species of birds easily. Everything that is native to, um, to South Alabama, except maybe black bears, uh -huh. <laughs> we've, we've got out here. You have to be careful. I mean, it is a wildlife refuge, so you are going to see alligators. You are going to see snakes. Some of them are going to be venomous. Um, but if you're just prudent and cautious, don't put your hands or feet anywhere you can't see them, then you, you should be okay. How you explore the refuge depends on your choice of transportation. There are boat ramps in Alabama and in Georgia. Canoers and kayakers can put in almost anywhere they can safely reach the water. Gravel roads wind through much of the refuge. A few were designed as wildlife driving trails and open to cars. But large parts of the refuge are only open to pedestrian and biking traffic. At the, at the Kennedy unit where we're going now, you're talking, um, you could easily spend a couple of hours on foot in there walking the, um, walking the roads and if you're taking your time and you're you're being quiet and looking for birds and alligators um, it's gonna you're gonna be walking pretty slowly it's really a it's a little gem that I don't know that a, that a lot of folks know about <laughs> 